Of course, I don't feel bad about turning in my umbrella. Hmm. <laughs> Trick or treat! Is it Halloween in the Hydra Empire? Sadly not. Living Mummy, Morbius, and Man-Thing are simply trying to enjoy a cup of joe at a cafe. But unfortunately, they seem to be upsetting the locals, which is getting our hideous trio a little ticked. Where's the tolerance for the unusual in the city? Man-Thing seems to say with his slurping vegetable mouth. Sorry, Moss Features. Hydra folks are not known for their accepting and fun-loving personalities. I'd be more scared of them than they are of you, to be honest. Hold the phone. Maybe I was wrong about Hydra's attitude to fun. A parade? Through Hydra Square? Perfect, thinks Morbius. If we enter a float, give out sweets, we can show everyone we are not just three hideous monsters. Uh, Man-Thing is on board. The living mummy just moans at all the work he'll have to do. Ooh, hammering. I love a parade, and I love monsters. So I'm super excited to see how this turns out. Go on, help these poor dudes while I try to get in on the fun. See if you can spot me. Good luck with the crazy float idea, monster dudes. And here we are. Live at the weekly Red Skull Honorary Parade in Hydra Square. And oh my, oh my, do we have some wonderful parade floats on show today! That's right, Gwen. They sure know how to put on a good show here in the Hydra Empire! Come, my friends. We must construct our parade float and win first prize! Okay, okay. Looks like we have a new float being prepared down below, Gwen. Yes, Gwen. It seems like the monstrous trio of Morbius, Living Mummy, and Man-Thing want to join in on the fun, too.
do, Gwen. And the crowd are going wild down there. Hail Hydra, immortal Hydra. My Hydra technology is superior to all. I sure hope the guy driving that forklift truck has insurance. Oops. Seems there's some kind of liquid vibranium spillage out near the restrooms. Oh, and now those have collapsed too. It's chaos down there, Gwen. It sure is, Gwen. I don't know what to make of this, but if those guys aren't careful, there won't be a parade left to take part in. How do I get myself in these crazy situations? Yes, I did. Ah, it's more beautiful than I ever imagined. Now to sit back and enjoy the ride with a nice glass of plasma. Mmm, plasma. We are no heroes. We are monsters and proud of it. All aboard, Tutu. 
our three monsters certainly showed the folk of the Hydra Empire that they're not just hideous, shambling oddballs. Taking pride of place in the parade, our boys are showing a new, open, and friendly side to the crowd. Maybe the civilians weren't quite ready to see this new side, however. In fact, it's difficult to tell exactly what's going through the crowd's mind as they seem to be stunned into silence, or maybe paralyzed with fear. It's a tough crowd, this one, guys. I think even adorably cute Groot would have a hard time melting those hearts. Still, if the crowd turn ugly, the living mummy has loads of bandages to patch up his boys if they take a bump. I'm going to try and make good our escape. Onward! It's Gwenpool here, and I'm here to say, a brand new mission is ready to play! Mic drop. GP, out. Trick or treat! Is it Halloween in the Hydra Empire? Sadly not. Living Mummy, Morbius, and Man-Thing are simply trying to enjoy... And here we are! Live at the weekly Red Skull Honorary Parade in Hydra Square. And oh my, oh my, do we have some wonderful parade floats on show today! That's right, Gwen. They sure know how to put on a good show here in the Hydra Empire. How do I get myself in these crazy situations? Thanks for getting me out of that jam, true believers. Excelsior!
Excelsior!